Hi everybody, it's great to be back. Thank you for all the birthday shout outs. Here's the deal. We have dry weather for the daytime today. If you're a commuter to New York City, have all of your rain gear. If you don't get home in Connecticut until 7, 8 o'clock, even 6 o'clock this evening, have your rain gear as well. We are going to see a Litchfield County special. What do I mean by that? That's where most of the wet snow accumulation will end up happening. I do want you to get up a few minutes earlier tomorrow to make sure your area is OK. But notice here National Weather Service with a winter storm warning in the northwest corner. And there are going to be some very high snow amounts, especially in this area right in here. Could be 10 inches of snow in those highest elevations of Litchfield County. And that would be happening tonight into tomorrow. There's also another little area of snow possible up here at the top of I-84 around Union. Around Waterbury, it looks like 0 to 3 there. Same thing, Danbury. But once you get into these higher elevations right in here, there could be 6 to 10 inches of wet snow, even a few power outages. I think New Haven's mainly rain, but central areas, Meriden, Hartford, even Killingly, it could go back and forth with rain and a little bit of wet snow. So clouds coming in through the day today, dry for the daylight hours. Let's plan on that rain and snow arriving this evening, 5 to 9 p.m. It could go back and forth tonight. For example, the Waterbury area, 0 to 3. That means low elevations, not a lot. Higher elevations, a few inches. So there could be some school issues tomorrow morning, especially for Litchfield County. Now the shoreline. This is going to be rain and wind. We need to watch high tide. It does clear out for the weekend. No issues Saturday and Sunday. Next storm will be later next week. It looks like a Thursday afternoon evening arrival, but we have a long time to watch that. It is going to be colder too later in the weekend through most of next week. Have a good day today. Stay on top of the updates on the News 8 app, WTNH.com and on TV as well. Have a great day.